Members, welcome again. Um, this month's newsletter, we're focusing on alignment, posture, grip, and ball position. Now, before you even hit a golf shot, your alignment is so important. You've got to make sure that you're aiming at your target. Now, I give a lot of golf lessons, and so many times I have to go through alignment and double check where my pupil or student is aiming, and quite often, they're aiming not to the target. Generally, they're aiming right at their target. Now, number one is alignment. When you're practicing, or even when you're playing, you've got to make sure you're aligned properly. How do we do that? As you can see, for this exercise, I've placed a couple of alignment rods on the ground. Now, the right alignment lot is aiming on the ball flight line. The left one is aiming where my feet are aiming. So when I go and set up for a shot, well, how do I do it? I stand behind the ball, I have a look where I'm aiming. I pick a spot. Now if I'm aiming down the middle of the fairway, I have to pick a spot about two feet in front of the, in front of the ball on the same line I want my ball to travel on. So for example today, I'm picking this little piece of grass. And that gives me a line. And basically when I have this here, the rod here, that just makes sure every time I'm practicing that I am setting up correctly without having to go through the whole pre-shot routine. So I have a line here. I put my club behind the ball. I take my stand. And I try to get my, my feet parallel with my line here. So I have one line here with my feet and one line here with the mark I've picked as my ball flight line for the target. When I hit my shot, after I make a nice swing, I try to make sure my club head chases through the spot that I picked in front of the ball. If you do that, you're giving yourself the best chance you can to hit that ball online and finish on the green or near your target on the fairway. A lot of people question ball position. Now I'm a firm believer in trying to keep our ball position as simple as possible. Mostly, every shot I play is played just inside the left heel. As you can see, with my warm-up stick here, is my ball position is just inside my left heel, and I've got a 7 iron in my hand. Now, if I'm hitting a short shot like a wedge, I may be closer to it, but my ball position is still just inside my left heel. And if I'm hitting my driver, Again, I may be a little bit further away from it, but my ball position is the same spot. Ball position, very important. If you tend to put that ball position too far back in your stance, you're going to end up coming into the ball too early and forcing many, many bad shots, mainly to the right. If you have questions on ball position, please come and ask me. Have a chat. A ball position and alignment is so important. Now if we move around this side a little bit and we talk about our posture. When we set up over the ball and we've gone through our pre-shot routine, our posture over the ball basically should be 50-50 weight distribution with two legs. Our weight should be moved forward a fraction so that you feel your posture and your weight on the balls of your feet. So you're leaning in towards, the, in towards the golf ball. The reason being is when we make our downward swing, we want to make sure we continue to move through the ball and finish high and to the target line. If our posture is poor at address, and we take our club away, we end up moving off the ball, causing again a slice, maybe a hook. But you're going to have very inconsistent shots. And to finish off, the golf grip. Most golfers know the golf grip. And for those that don't, you know, we need to make sure we take the club in our left hand, running down the fingers. The left thumb sits right on top, facing the club head. Our right finger has two grips. You can either use an interlocking grip, which is interlocking the the fingers this way or you can use an overlapping grip 
I use the overlapping grip, but either is fine. Tendency is people with smaller hands like an interlocking grip. The baseball grip, I don't recommend the baseball grip, and obviously the reverse grip, I don't recommend that as well. Both grips lead to too many inconsistent shots, and if you're serious about your goal, having the correct grip is so important. What I do see with a lot of golfers when they take their grip is their right hand is way too strong. So please members, try to get your right hand and your right thumb across the top. All right, so your left thumb sits on top and your right thumb is right over the top. My grips are basically quite plain. They're a leather grip, very nice to play golf with. But a lot of golf grips have pictures on the grips or little lines. These lines are here to assist you in making sure your thumb is in the right positions when you do take your grip. If you're unsure about your grip, your posture, your alignment, your ball position, you know, I'm a PJ member, have been for 20 years. It's our job to service you, the golfers of Morissette. So please come in, have a chat, and we're only too willing to help you out. Enjoy the newsletter.